This is Geneva, near the French border at the foot of the Alps. It's home to the European Organisation of Nuclear Research, where deep below ground, scientists are trying to recreate the Big Bang to discover how the universe works. They're using the new Large Hadron Collider, a particle accelerator which consists of this underground tunnel, 17 miles in circumference, and four of these huge magnetic detectors positioned around the ring. Particles were accelerated to 99.9% .9 the speed of light, then fired into the tunnel in opposite directions, where they smashed together underneath one of the four detectors in a microscopic recreation of the Big Bang. A visual representation of the collision, similar to this, is recorded, which enables scientists to see what happened to the particles in the beginning of the universe. Each of the four detectors, CMS, ATLAS, ALICE and LHCB, is designed for a certain purpose. This is the CMS detector and its sister ATLAS. These detectors are designed to search for the Higgs particle, a theoretical particle whose existence would validate the current theory of how massless particles during the Big Bang came to have mass and therefore come together to create the universe. Discovering whether this particle exists is the main purpose of the LHC. ALICE, a large ion collider experiment, is designed to study quark gluon plasma a liquid matter created during the collision of lead ions to further our understanding of particle physics. The LHCB detector is different to the other detectors because its purpose is to find what's called dark matter. Dark matter is matter which has mass but is invisible and accounts for most of the mass in the universe. LHCB's purpose is finding out which particles this matter consists of. So that's the Large Hadron Collider, the world's largest and most powerful particle accelerator, which will not only expand our knowledge of particle physics, but could explain the universe's makeup and its creation. What it won't do is create a black hole and cause the end of the world, which is good.